You know, I know I'm a few minutes early, but my, my, might as well. I'm, I I'm typically am early to places. So that's just the story of my life. And I'm just sitting here, so I might as well go live. Hello and happy Monday. Happy Monday, everybody. I hope that you guys all had a great weekend with some fabulous weather. The weather was amazing here. Very hot. Um, but, and very, um, what are those things called? cicada E. Are you getting a lot of cicadas where you're at? Let's see. There we are. It, you know, you can hear the cicadas here, like in the, the background, but I've not really seen tons of them on like my tree. Hello. Oh, now I see your comments. But occasionally one will like fly over right like when I'm getting ready to get into my car or something like that. And it flips out. And my husband's like, they don't hurt you. They don't have any teeth. They, they have no, like their only defense mecha mechanism is that they come in numbers. Well, I don't want them on me because they are noisy and just ugly. And I know that the bird, apparently, fun fact. Did you know that... The cicadas, they're, they come out like this because they just want to mate. They want to mate. And they mate and they mate and they mate and they mate so much and they mate as often as they can to eventually their, or their sexual organs fall off. Fun fact. You're welcome. So that's what happens to the cicadas. According to a podcast that my husband listened to. Which is weird. Why, why would you listen to a podcast about cicadas? Sparkwood. Anyway, <laughs> I hope you guys all had a great weekend. I have one, two, three, four, five, six packages. Hey, Daniel. Hi, LaDonna. LaDonna? LaDonna. Make more. The, the bees make more cicadas? Hi, Kathy. I have six packages, so I'm going to go ahead and start opening a couple of them because as soon as I'm done opening up these friend mail packages, we will go over to the shelves and we will pick things that will be for sale tomorrow during the threes company sale, the three-way sale. Before I forget to, ugh, Roxana, you, ooh, no, even as a kid, I couldn't do the cicadas. Um, tonight, the Vintage Rescue Squad will be on Michael's channel. It will be Michael, uh, the Cult of Vintage. It will be on his channel tonight. And we're going to have uh, Aaron from the Collection Vintage and Rachel from Superior Girl Vintage. So that's going to be a fun show tonight. So I hope that you guys can make it. It will be on Michael's channel. Cicadas make more babies. They do. So much till their organs fall off. Okay. So this first package I'm going to open, it, is it? Okay, it's 11.01, so I can't be getting in trouble for, op for opening them up early. We have cicadas in Maine, but nowhere near at the South Woods. I mean, I could show you videos of, from what some of my fr friends that live in this in my town have posted that will make your skin crawl. I mean, they are just like the whole base of their tree is just covered. Like, you can't even see the ground. It's nothing but cicadas. Ugh. All right, this first package is from Melinda Hess. Hi, Tiger. Hey, Carrie. This is from Melinda, and she is in Blandon, Pennsylvania. I'll cut this one open. All right. It's got a little card in here. Should I know what's the case? Oh gosh, Tiger. You, you can you can um, Google them if you want to, but they're harmless apparently. Hi, Virginia. They're harmless. We're talking about cicadas, Virginia, but they are nasty, and they make this. I don't mind the sound that they make because it's a very summery sound. Hey, proud American. It's a very summery sound, but they're just gross. It's like a cross between a June bug and a and a bee. Or a dragonfly, because they got these huge wings. Anyway, here is the card. This is from Melinda. Thank you, Misty. I enjoy all your videos and live sales. Enclosed are a few items that you can keep or sell. 
I had a yard sale and had a very little business and had very little business. I took a car load to Goodwill. Hopefully someone will profit. I hated giving it to them, but I have too much. Melinda Hess. Yard sales are hard work to do. They really are. You play with the vintage conversation. Ugh, they're just crunchy and ugh. Well, well, you know, here we're live. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh my. Okay, you guys. Melinda, are you here? Look at these brooches. Here is a little gray kitty cat. There's a gray kitty cat. Yes, there is a fungus that will turn them into. I heard that. Apparently, they're full of fungus. And like, they, fungus that will make you high. So people around here probably start eating them. It makes their butts fall off. Carrie, did you see? Do you know that they procreate over and over and over again until all those parts fall off, to, off too? Oh, isn't cute? He's got little uh, yellow eyes. Look at these. I don't know if Melinda's here or not. The new Tide Pods. Oh, gosh. Yes, Virginia. Oh, they gross. This is a big bear and a little bear brooch. These are so cute. And here is a wishbone. This is nice to wear at Thanksgiving time. Yeah, they are hardcore. Oh, my gosh. And then we've got a Puda. The red eye. I love when they give things red eyes. Makes them look like a zombie. Then we have, oh, this one's cute. I think this might be a hummingbird. So little, a little hummingbird. It's blue and green. And then we have another Puda. And she is fancy because she's got a little bow in her hair. I'm fancy. Yeah, and a little bow in her tail right there. Then this one is really pretty. It's a parrot with a red jeweled eye. So it's a zombie parrot. It's blue and gold. Aren't they pretty? Oh, Melinda, these are lovely. She has them all in this little box. So nice. I can't believe those didn't sell at your yard sale because those are the kinds of brooches that I look for when I go to yard sales. So those are beautiful. And then she also sent couple little things in here oh this is cute a little Campbell soup kid magnet you know I'm gonna keep this because when Emma was little everyone said that she looked like the little Campbell soup girl so I'm gonna keep that hey vintage and vino hi Sharon I'm gonna save the bubble wrap Ooh, Virginia like this. Look at this bluebird, Virginia. Uh, well, I that's, guess that's what they're called, bluebirds. That's what their name is, right? They're a bluebird, right? Hi, Nancy. Hi, moon goddess. And then, oh, another little, oh, this is cute. A little glass sun catcher of these little cherub angels. This one right here is in deep thought. It's pondering why were cicadas created? And that one's like, I don't know. Little babies. Little babies. Blue bird or blue. That's what I was thinking of. Blue jay. Blue jay. I'm, I'm just different. I don't know. Blue bird, blue jay. Sometimes I forget the names of things and the names of people. So thank you so much, Melinda. That was very, very kind. Very, very kind. I appreciate it. Okay, the next one is from H.M. Parker from Liberty Lake, Washington. And look at how pretty the packaging is. Words are hard. Words are hard. Math is hard. I'm surprised I can even make it in one piece every day. Survive on this planet. Again, we've talked about this too when you feel like, Hi, Mayor. You feel like sometimes when you're driving and you're like, where am I going? Where am I going? And I'll like completely pass like the road that I was supposed to turn on. You kind of zone out. 
Ooh, look at this pretty package. Okay, let me open up the card first. Misty. I like that. Just I like markers. Oh, green eggs and ham. Sam I am. Oh. <gasps> oh. Oh my gosh. You guys. Okay, are you ready for the most glorious thing that you will see all day? Proud American. This will make you an even prouder American. Are you ready? It's Liberace in his red, white, and blue. Stars and stripes forever. Isn't that great? Oh my gosh. Someone had po posted that somebody had a life-size cutout of Liberace. Yes, thank you, Melinda. I appreciate that. That was very kind. Life-size cutout. And he was dressed in these clothes. I knew you would, proud American. Look at, look at, he's got some, Liberace had some nice legs. I mean, they're a little hairy, but they're nice. Liberace, look at his shoes. He's a Wisconsin boy. It says, wouldn't this look great in a 4th of July display? Yes, but I would also, will keep this out year round, not just for the holidays. Okay, oh my gosh, she's got such nice and neat handwriting. He is strutting his stuff. Hi, Angela. Hi, my life is Antique White and Donna. All right, it says, hello, Misty. Thank you so much for the fun, education, and much needed distraction over this past year. I'm not a reseller, but I've loved being a part of this amazing community. I do have collections both at school and at home. I was going to say, when I see this and this, she's a teacher. She says, I teach third grade in Washington State. I would offer you my skills in light stocking, but I, I come across, oh yes, I would offer you my skills in light stocking, but I'm across the state from Liz Retros. Liz Retros, oh, you, you're safe. I won't send her to peep in your windows. You're safe. Thank you again. Happy early birthday, Holly Parker. H.M. Parker on YouTube and Liberty Lake on Instagram. P.S. The vinyl is from the farmer's market I helped run in my hometown. Thought it would make a good package topper. Oh. Oh, yeah. Liberty Lake Farmer's Market. You know what? I'm going to put this on my laptop, actually. I'm not going to give it away. I'm going to keep it. I have stickers all over my laptop. Somebody's knocking on the door. Somebody's knocking on the door. We're not going to answer the door. I can't. I got you all here. I'm busy. Okay, that was just, oh my gosh. This is another way that you can tell. Scholastic book order. And I loved the smelling of, smelling of the new books when they would come in. Okay, so here's a little pack. It's not the stalker. I don't know who it is. No, it's not the man from last month. No, I don't know. You need Charlie to answer the door. No, I don't. I can't. I'm fine. Hang on a minute. I'll be right back. Lisa, it's just Le it's just Lisa Holbrook, guys. It's just Lisa Holbrook. <laughs> Are people hiding? <laughs> no, I'm not live. So like, oh, okay. okay. <laughs> Thank you. There's all your things. I'm 
to get all. I, I wish that we could chat a few minutes. That's all right. I understand. I love your purple hair. <laughs> Thank you. You're so fun. I love your purple. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I like purple. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll open the box here live or on the film, so oh, I'll watch it later. All right. Well, you know, you can come by any time. Thank you. And then pop in and take a better look. Okay. Okay. Thank good. you so much, Lisa. I appreciate Thank it. Thank you. Thanks. <laughs> I dropped Lisa's box. Phew! Oh my gosh. It's okay. You know what? Here's the deal. My next door neighbor is right there. And he will he will be there like that. And he's a big strong guy. So no worries. No worries. The door is locked. It was. It was Lisa Holbrook. You guys know Lisa Holbrook. She's in the chats a lot. I feel kind of bad because I don't know how far she she drove and I, I want to be able to like spend time with her. I don't think she drove, drove from very far. Let's see. She's in Indiana, I know. Okay, let's go. Okay, we're still, we're still opening this package here. Yeah, but sometimes people forget. I forget too. We're still opening Holly's Park. Holly's Parker. Holly's gift. Holly's gift. In this fun rainbow paper. And now we've got green paper. Oh, I need more of these. Did you, if you saw on Instagram, I posted, I, um, I have a scotch tape display. Oh yeah. Yeah. Jason's my bodyguard. He's, he's, he's right there. Actually like all four of the guys that work over there are like, they know. Um, plus we've got cameras. We have cameras. There's a camera filming me right now. There's a camera outside. There's a camera backside. There's a camera facing the, we got cameras everywhere. But anyway, but I appreciate you guys' concern. Thank you. I had Mark find, well, I found a um, metal insert for a Hoosier cabinet that you put the spices in. And it was just a little bit longer than the Scotch tape display that I have. And so Mark hung it underneath it. And so now I've got two packages. Thank you, Denise. Nope, my shop is about mm, five miles or so from, from my house. Holly, thank you so much. Oh my gosh, where did he go? Where'd you go, Lee? There he is. Lee Liberace. I love the Scott. Oh, you know what? The yellow ones are, when you find them, it's a little fun because you're like, is that? Oh, yes. And I've even found um, some that aren't Scotch tape tins, but they... I mean, there's they're, they're, they're tape, and I still throw those in there in my display. Thank you so much, Holly. All right, then the next thing we have is from Sybil Jorgensen, and she is in Iowa. Sybil, Sybil, do you know the Pride of Iowa? The Pride of Iowa is Sarah from Thrift Jew. She's the Pride of Ira. I always get nervous. Okay, this is pull tab to open. So let's do this the pull tab to open way. <gasps> Ooh. <gasps> what? Okay, let's make sure I got everything. Here is a card. Oh my word. It is an old magazine. Let's get she's the pride of Ira. Of Ira? Iowa. Misty. This is from Sybil. Aw. Looks like Stella. I really enjoy watching your YouTube channel. You are an excellent, you do an excellent job and so fun to watch. Haven't seen your dad in the in a hall lately. Well, he was in 
Friday's video. He doesn't always like to do it. I have to sometimes convince him. Hope he's well. He's fine. Anyway, I attended an auction this weekend. This magazine is in the lot I purchased. I really enjoyed looking through it. I believe it was wit written in Norwegian. Oh, boy. It is, but we'll have fun looking at the pictures. Anyway, I'm sending it to you to do with as you wish. I figured someone would really enjoy it. Thank you for the wonderful entertainment your channel provides to so many. Take care, Sybil Jorkson. Thank you, Sybil. Yeah, this is. But it by looking at it, it looks like it has some pretty cool graphics in it. It is called, Ill, well, Ill, I don't know. Let's call that. She's drinking out of the spigot. But look at this guy. He's smoking a cigarette. King size. A king size cigarette. So is she. I had seen somewhere that there were, I think it was at the Smithsonian. Some, it was another travel vlogger that I watched. And they had, in the Smithsonian, they had these posters of doctors and people that were advertising for smoking. Oh, Wow. It is in nor it's in a different language, but let me find a cool picture. Oh, look at them! Fun ephemera, and some of the ads in here. Oh, laundry detergent! Everybody, no matter what country you're in, what year is this from? 1959. I love hose water too. There was just something that, thank you so much, Sybil. I will look through this. This is pretty cool. Maybe Tiger. Tiger, you don't, what, Tiger, are you here? Because it kind of looks German to me. Do you know what that says, Tiger? Well, at least, you can at least tell me what language it's in. Tiger, if anything, if it, if, it's in German. I should send it to you, Tiger, and then you can read it to us. You could read this vintage magazine to us on your YouTube channel. Helfen Kaferken Maid Blonde. Did I say that right? Helen Kaferken Maid Blonde. Oh, it's in Danish. Mm. Do you speak Danish, Tiger? <sighs> okay. Thank you so much, Sybil. Yeah. Hey, Stephanie. All right. The next, the next box is from just Stacy. That's what it says. Just Stacy from Massachusetts or Maryland. I can't tell if that, <laughs> I know that. you know what? Whenever I think that I'm speaking German, it always ends up like the Swedish chef, which is not German at all. But anyway, I think just Stacy is either from Massachusetts or Maryland. I can't tell if that's an A or a D. Here's her card. Oh, pretty. And hello, Misty. I found a golden book and I know that I had to send it to you. I'm also sending along a little odds and ends. Please keep sell or do whatever you wish with them. I know you'll find good homes for them all. The Vaseline glass what? is mismatched. Is a mismatched set. One glows and one doesn't. I've been meaning to send this package for a while now and I honestly don't remember exactly what's in it. So we'll both be surprised. Sorry there's no, there's not any potato chips. Uh love Stacy. On her Poshmark is Sunrise Styles on Poshmark. Well, we're going to be surprised together. Stacy from Maine or Maryland. Oh, got some package paper. Oh my goodness. Look at how pretty. Ah. This so this Stacy, this is beautiful. I'm going to take these off. I'm going to slide them off. I'm not going to cut them because I can untie them later and then I will reuse them as well as this tissue paper. This is so nice. 
Oh my gosh. Everything I need to know I learned from a little golden book. Oh, this is cool. This has, I think it has a bunch. Yeah. Oh no. I th See, when I have seen these before, I thought that they were like just a contemplation. Contem compilation, compilation of many golden books. But, oh my gosh, Sugar Bridges lost her braids. Oh, look, little baby Jeffrey's waking up. Oh, little baby Jeffrey. Oh my gosh, this is cool. Bird watching. Use your imagination. Oh, this is so cute. Cultivate contentment, boy. That's a good one for last but several days. She does wrap beautifully. I love that. Oh, so then we have some Jack Daniels gentlemen's playing cards. No women can use these cards, only gentlemen. There's Jack Daniel himself. There he is. Only men can use these here cards. Movie trivia. Okay, this will be fun to use as package toppers. Here, let's just try one real quick. I'll just pull one out of the back. Um, Will Smith's two, 2007 movie, I Am Legend, is set in what U.S. city? Does anybody know? Will Legend's 2007 movie, I Am Legend, is set in what U.S. city? Let me know. Nope, it's not Boston. It's not Bo Boston. It's not the one where he was a, yep, New York. That's when he was a robot? Or was that iRobot? That's not iRobot. iRobot is a vacuum cleaner. Is that the one where he's a robot? Hi, Pamela. We're opening up friend mail first. Got a little purple package here. Purple. This might be the Vaseline glass because it's yellow. I can see it through the bubble wrap. Yep, it's a cup and saucer. I do believe I got my black light over here somewhere. Well, you would think, let me, gr let me grab my black light. They sure do look like they match, but the, uh, the cup, you can't really tell because the bright lights, the cup does glow, but the plate does not, not even around the rims. It's still very pretty. Very nice for spring and summer. That's really pretty. Pretty. Oh my gosh, there's all kinds of stuff in here. The next package. Watch Omega Man. I Am Legend is based off of it. It's a real cheesy movie. Which is real cheesy, Linda? The Omega Man or... I am legend. I don't think I've ever seen I am legend either. <gasps> oh my word. It's a rooster. Solamine made in Italy. It's an Italian rooster. You know, it would be really cute for an airplane. Or you could put your cream in it and then the rooster out the cream. This is fun. These just look so cool on... Ooh, Charlton Heston. Be still my heart. They look cute up on a shelf. Oh my, some plate stands. These are very useful. Oh, thank you. The, these are great to use for when you're taking pictures or just for display. Got another little package here. I'm saving all the saving all the stuff I can. Oh, yep. Chicks and hens. I need to go out and thin mine out. I was outside out back for a little bit yesterday and they are, I need to thin them out. I have so many hens and chicks. Ooh, 
This is an Otagiri. What kind of animal do you think the top half is? It is Otagiri. Hi, Kay. Okay, do you know what type of animal the top half is? It was a, oh, ooh. This is a fun little sugar, a sugar bowl of a rabbit. Oh. See, that's where you put your little spoon. It is a bunny with pink eyes. Those are the ones I like. This is really fun. A lot of people like bunnies. I know Lynn, if Lynn is watching, she loves bunnies. A dinosaur <laughs> from American You Crack Me Up. All right, the next feels like a tin. Remington Recipes. That is really cool. It has like a Western or like a chuck wagon. Scene. Well, here's the chuck wagon scene. And it's got pretties inside. My goodness. Look at that. Daniel, what'd you say? The creepy red-eyed rabbits. Yeah. We got Littles, which I love. Oh, I don't know if Randy's watching, but we got a deer. Souvenir of Hershey, Pennsylvania. Little deer. It is marked Japan on the back. Cutie. I love little, little bitty things so much. Ooh, this is a little candy. I think it's a candy container. He's got a little necklace on of a little terrier dog, it looks like. He's got a little necklace on. I've never seen one with a little necklace on. Next, we have a little, this is made in Japan. I'm going to say Cocker Spaniel. What do you guys think? Do you think Cocker Spaniel? Kind of looks like it. I thought a wiener dog at first, but I think that's a Cocker Spaniel. I think so. Next, we, oh, this is a, I think it says style craft. Oh, it's a little chubby nugget of a bird. <gasps> Look at how cute. It's a little nuggy. I think it's style craft, Taiwan. Hi, Scott. I didn't even see you were here. I hope you're doing well. Not going too stir crazy. Hi, Susan. Um, I think so, Betsy. I think it depends on what kind what kind of graphic that they have on them. Um, I think that if you they probably would sell better as a lot, like if you had a lot of them together. Here is a little, I think a little toothpick holder of a green car. I don't think. I mean, we just check. We just we just check to be on the to just just to be sure. But super cute with a this will be great for Father's Day. Oh, yes. Father's Day with a little airplane in it and dad can put it on his desk. That would be a good little gift. But that's a little tin of happiness from the Remington Recipes box. Then we've got a little, I think these are probably package choppers. Christmassy. Little package toppers are Santa. These are cute. These will be fun package toppers because they're like little cardboard ornaments. This is a little card. And they've got the envelopes with them. So this is perfect. France. Joy to the world. Oh. Stacy, I'm trying to get this back in here. Stacy, these are beautiful. These are perfect for package choppers. Thank you, thank you. And then Stacy sent one other little little package in here. This is a this is fun. Sounds like another tin. Oh, tissue paper up here. <laughs> when I first saw this, I thought it said Beanie Weenies. No, 
It says Benny Wafers. A crisp, sweet, wafer-thin cookie with a delightful flavor. I thought it said Beanie Weenies, but that's, that was just me glancing down at Do you guys know what Beanie... You know what Beanie Weenies are, right? Oh, my gosh! There's more! Stacy. These are like little marble... Here's a little marble donkey. Or some sort of a stone donkey. Here's a little man... Oh my gosh, this other one is so cute. He is eating something out of that pot. And then this is adorable. Oh my gosh, this is moose antler. Oh, oh, this is so cute. Look at the little Eskimo baby. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. Oh, he's so cute. I love his little face. Hi, Carol. Scott, I haven't been to Canada since I was a child. When we would go up to the northern, or the upper peninsula, we would sometimes drive over the border. I just think that was so cool because we would go and exchange our money. Do they even do that anymore? I don't know if they do or not. Oh, she's cute. I don't know if she's a single shaker. We'll see if she's got her partner with her or not, but she's got a nice little basket of flowers. She's a little frozen Charlotte-esque. Frozen, so I like these, even though they're not like a traditional frozen Charlotte. Um, they These do blend in nice with another collection of frozen Charlottes. Hi, Denise. I'm glad you did. We're opening packages. We've got a couple more to open, and then we are going to... Go shopping. Oh, Carrie. <gasps> Carrie, look at this. This is an Andrea by Sadik Owls. They have seen some things. I would love to, Scott, but I don't think they'll let me in. These are Andrea by Sadik. I just bought a, car, a cardinal one. It's marked Andrea. These are the more collectible ones. They're bisque. You know, those owls are a hoot. There is the sticker and the stamp on the bottom. The only issue is that there's a little twig that's broken. On the back, they stand. Let me see if they stand. They don't stand real well. I bet that was the other part. To help make it stand up. But those are still very cute. They have seen some things. Oh, we got two of those deer from Hershey, Pennsylvania. They look like they need a nap. There's two. They're not shakers either. So two deer lovers could have one. I would like to go to the Yukon for a day to see it, but I don't think I could stay there. There's nothing to do. Oh, she's got... Well, I mean, there, there are outdoorsy things to do. I shouldn't say there's nothing to do. There are outdoorsy things to do, and I'm not really that much of an outdoorsy girl. Oh, what makes it... Yes, it's that bisque because it's bisque. Bisque always feels dusty to me. Yeah, the Yukon is about the scenery. So, okay. No, they don't go together. I thought, well, maybe they go together, but they don't. She's made in Japan. I think he is made, well, no, he's, he's hand-painted Japan, too. They're both just figurines. They could be sold together. Hey, Ladale. Opening up some friend mail. Stacy, thank you so much. That was so kind. That was so fun. Thank you so much. I love it all. I love it all. It's so fun. Move that over here. I tend to after when I get when I have several boxes, then I get buried in paper. But thank you so much, Stacy. I appreciate it. Hi, Gia. Yeah, I love to camp. I love to camp, but I like to camp in a camper, not in. A, you know, I like to have air conditioning in a, in a bed. This next box is from Cheryl Christian in Michigan. Cheryl Christian in Michigan. 
paper. Oh, 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 wow. A whole thing of books. Okay. Wait a minute. I'm going to say, I think these, I sold her these books, but it's made. Oh, Cheryl. Okay. Cheryl sent these. They, I sent them to the wrong Cheryl. But that Cheryl never, <laughs> okay, it's a long story. But these books, we're not going to show these because they'll be for sale again. Long story. But thank you, Cheryl, for sending them back. I truly appreciate it. I do. She didn't have to because she, she, I, I sent them to her and they weren't, they didn't even go to her. She was kind enough to send them back. Hi, Jody. Yeah, you know it happens. All right, this next box, when I first saw it, I thought, oh, no, because it has my sticker on it. Let me cover up the address. But it is from Jean Metware. She sent this to me. Miss Jean, I hope you're there. She, yeah, she said, I am sending you. <laughs> she did. She said, I am sending you a stand for Liberace. She did. So, Liberace. Oh, I love, I love that she tied a little bow around it, too. That's so sweet. Liberace has a proper doll stand now. If you don't know Liberace, I have a Liberace doll. And he just kind of leans up against things because it doesn't have a proper stand. But Jean, this will be perfect because it's nice and tall. Thank you, Jean. I'm a, I will put this on Liberace just as soon as we are done. Thank you, Jean. All right, and then the next box I'm going to open is from Lisa Holbrook, who was just here. Lisa was here. I feel so bad, Lisa. The next time you're in town, Lisa, we'll meet up for lunch. And we'll hang out a little bit. She's so cute and all her purple. She's got like purple shades in her hair. She's so cute. She bought stuff for me and said she was going to pick it up. And then she brought me. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh, I'm sorry. You guys have time for me to do this? I'll try to make it. I'll try to open up fast. Oh my goodness. Lisa. Lisa. Mm. Okay, and there's ribbons that I that I will reuse. Oh, I know, but I didn't know. I don't know if she really wanted to be on. Okay, Lisa, what did you bring me? trying to save the bubble wrap <laughs> but I'm trying to save the bubble wrap at the same time I'm trying to <gasps> oh what oh, I wonder if the rest is in here it's a little napkin holder oh my gosh and it still has the original price sticker okay so it is a napkin holder with a little deer on it there's where you put your napkins and I wonder if the salt and pepper shakers are still on the inside but it has the original price tag from M.H. Fishman Company for 79 cents. Oh my gosh, I love that. I wonder if these little nuggets are the shakers. Myrtle is growling. Myrtle, you be good. Be good, kitty. Do these, are these, oh my. Oh, yes, they are. Just wait, I'll get it all together. Let me get it all together. Trying to hurry. Trying to hurry.
Lisa, this is epic. Just wait. Wait till you see that I've seen some things in this box that you can't see yet. Oh my gosh, these are so adorable. Look at that. They've got the little shakers. Look, it kind of looks like Bambi, but kind of not. Isn't that so cute? Oh, that is so amazing. Lisa looks purple like Lisa. Lisa said she likes purple. Okay. Sorry, I know I the opening things I know a lot of people don't like, so like the oh I see a head. I see a head. Oh Oh that would be Oh my gosh, wait do you see this? It would be a great great for Christmas cards, you're right. This is Nippon. Is there a look at him? Okay, here's the back. I'm gonna do a Michael Todd. Okay, are you ready? There it is. Isn't it so lovely? Look at this. She's she's crowning! She's crowning! I see a head! Look at her! I love this so much! Air plant, give her some hair. Lisa, this is freaking amazing. <coughs> I'm coughing, I gotta take a drink. Look at that. She does kind of look like me, doesn't she? Hey, which way is her eyes looking? I love that. Oh my gosh, I love that. Lisa. Lisa, you done outdid yourself, girl. I know. I the expressions on anything. I, I love looking at the expressions on things. Like this little bird. He's so annoyed. Meh. It's just I just like stuff like that. Right, here's another little nugget. And then the other. Oh my gosh, you got you don't even know. You will. You'll know here in a minute. Oh my goodness! Heavens to Betsy! Are you kidding me? Lisa! Oh my goodness! She sent me a left in bloomer girl with her little hat box. Oh my word. Oh, I love this. She's going to go in my cabinet. And all these are just, these are so delicate and fun. Like it's so, it's such a thin porcelain right here and her little ribbons. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, isn't that precious? She and her little bows on her, on her little hat box are intact. Oh my gosh, Lisa. That's amazing. Okay, but just, okay, so there's some pretty epic tablecloths in here. Yeah, there's no breaks on that. It's, it's in pristine condition. Look at the tablecloths with, okay, these are, Oh my gosh, what flowers are these? Lilacs. It's a nice big tablecloth with lilacs. Oh my word. Lisa, this is amazing. And then this one. With cherries. With cherries. That's amazing. And cherry blossoms. Oh my gosh. I want to put this on my table. 
I love that. Then, oh, it's not, we're not done yet. Lisa, oh my gosh. I mean, these are amazing. It's the royal family. It's the golden album of the royal family. There are these little booklets. So we've got this one. So there's the royal family. And then we have Princess Anne, who is quite, she had quite an attitude. Prince Charles and Princess Anne. There's another Prince Charles and Princess Anne. Okay, my favorite royal, my favorite royal is Princess Margaret. She was my favorite royal. She was saucy. She was very, I, oh gosh, she just had attitude for days and had lived such a life in her sister's shadow. Could, could you imagine, could you imagine your sister being the queen? You know, sisters have like that an animosity a little bit anyway. Could you imagine if your sister, I cannot wait to read these. Prince, Princess Margaret's 19th birthday book. She was lovely. She was such a beauty. And then Elizabeth's wedding day. Oh yeah, she didn't, Stephanie. She did not give a flying. I cannot wait. I, what, I, I literally have watched everything on the royal family that I could find on YouTube, on Netflix, everything. Oh my gosh, look at Princess Margaret on her 19th birthday. Yeah, she did not. Oh, I loved her. She was my favorite royal. Then, oh my gosh. We have a whole, a popular portfolio, Queen Elizabeth, 1953. It's just Queen Elizabeth. She was a stunner. This is a notepad. It's a notepad. Look, a notepad. She came there in 1958. Oh, cool. I loved her. Greetings. With greetings and, and best of good wishes. Look, it is the queen. Who is quite the tomboy. This picture right here, the actress that played the queen in on the, the queen, no, um, the crown. That first season, it was, she did, she did her so well. She really, oh, oh, there's playing cards in here. Oh, look at, I have a couple of these playing cards of her mother and father um, on a flower frog, the king and the queen mother. What else is in here? Little bits of stationery. Gosh, these are amazing. What does this say? Two pence, half penny postage. That's so fancy. The 1953 coronation? What is this? What? What? Are these matches? There's matches from the coronation from 1953. This is amazing. Here's a card. Soldiers of the Queen, the coronation of Queen Elizabeth. Wow. And then the last thing is Another tablet. Souvenir of the royal visit in 
It's just a notepad. Oh, I love it. Oh my gosh, Lisa. Lisa, this was, and this was amazing. Oh my gosh, so amazing. Hi, Janice. Hi, Book B. I, I, I'm, spe I, I, listen, I, I am not rendered speechless very often, but I kind of am speechless right now. Hi, Margaret. That was amazing. That was amazing, amazing gifts. The every, things that everyone sent me was absolutely wonderful. Thank you so much. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. It's just, I just, I can't believe that people send me things, especially these things. That that was amazing. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much. I, I really, really do appreciate it. Okay. Are you ready to shop? Thank you, Nancy. I'm going to turn you around. And we've been on here a long time. I know it. I've got to wade through the, the carnage of stuff and not trip over the cords. Okay. Um, I had a basket, but I don't know where it went. We're just going to use this box. We're going to put our stuff in. So we are picking... Well, we're going to pick 12 things. Actually, we're going to pick 10 things today because some of these things I have. Um, well, we're going to we're going to pick we're going to pick 10 things today. These cats will be available in tomorrow's sale. And the green bird will either be tomorrow or Wednesday. Same with the chicken. And then the blue waterfall fairy lamp Ooh, cat will be in tomorrow so we're gonna pick 10 things hi shannon all right so we're going to let's see let's pick one of these art glass bowls uh this does glow it has a mic and has a piece of tape in it and then the green art glass The turtle paperweight. Turtle paperweight has sold, I think. No, it hasn't. Okay. Turtle paperweight. All right. We're doing a lot of our glass tomorrow. Looks like a mushroom. Bottom shelf and middle. Um, to the right, I have a cooler, okay, the yellow bowl, so we've got two, we're going to pick seven more things, the other side of the aisle. Oh, you're talking about this pot, maybe? This is a Rose Lane pot. I also have, we already picked the fairy lights. Got planters. Okay, gotcha. Is anybody seeing anything that they want me to grab? It's a little skunk and some luster elephants. The blue pig. Um, I don't think that it's signed. No, it's not signed. Linens. Yes, I do have some linens. I actually have some linens. Um, we'll go over there in just a second. We'll pick a few more things and we'll go over and pick a few linens. Um, we got some salt and pepper shakers. The cockatoo, no, these are not planters. They are statues. They're figures. I think they're pheasants. I have some books that will be, I'll be selling on Wednesday. Some readers. 
the kangaroo shakers. Okay. Orange on the right side of the aisle. I've got a crock pot down there. Hi, Jamie. Yes, Lilac, I think I, I sent, I, I'm so far behind on my emails. I did reply to your email, though. How about we sell the Boo We'll stick with the kangaroo family. Is everybody okay with the Boo This is a copper planter. Bunny rabbit. Good morning, flippin' flamingos. Um... Is someone saying that they want me to do this? I also have colorful beads. Okay, I'll do the copper planter. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Let's go over here and pick some linens. I'm losing my voice. I'm kind of going through here quick because I know I'm running way over. I have several linens with these little, like, little puppy and kitty in it. And then this little bear, it's catching its toast. <laughs> these creepy looking cats driving a car. And this is a quilt topper. I saw Virginia said a tablecloth. I don't really have any tablecloths. I have the quilt topper. This is a quilt topper. I have some really cute mom's crying towel. I think I have a dad's crying towel too. Okay, the quilt topper. Put it over here, and we'll pick a few more things. Actually, I have this box here. These are things that I was kind of pulling for Father's Day. I've got a hillbilly planter. Okay, and the crying towels. Okay, I will do that. I'll pull the crying towels. And the tea towels. All right, I will do that. I am actually, I'm on, <laughs> I hate to do this, but I'm going to have to go. Um, no, I don't have any more monster glass yet. I have ordered some more. Um, I'm sorry for the abrupt leaving, but I have to, something I have to take care of out here. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I promise we're going to have some cool things tomorrow. Make sure that you um, come back to or tonight for the vintage rescue squad will be on michael the cult of vintages channel thank you guys so much for spending monday with me i know the the it was a little bit longer of a video than what we um i had anticipated but i always love being able to spend time with you guys so thank you so much and as always don't forget to like share comment and subscribe bye